what a heat pump is is basically an air conditioner that can reverse its cycle and instead of um, supplying the house with air that's cool, it can supply the house with air that's hot. We actually located them on the south side so that when the winter sun travels across the sky and we need the heat, these are in the bright heat. I've seen enough evidence now that I believe the studies that say they're up to 20% more efficient when they're located in the sunlight for heating purposes and ideally in the summer with the overhang and the sun being traveling over the roof that way, they're located in the shade. Um, the, you have uh, heat travels in three ways, radiant heat, conductive and convective. And uh, what we get additionally by having the sun shine on them is we get a radiant heat effect that wouldn't be there. And they operate, it seems, incredibly efficiently. The other piece of equipment, which is part of uh, the uh, heat pump system, we have no natural gas to heat or cool the house. Uh, this is the air handler, the other part of the heats, and then the air distribution system. The other part of the uh, heating cooling system is a compressor outside which which comprises the other main element of the heat pump system. And what's wonderful is we only have our I should say, up till this year, we only had maybe four to six days a year that we needed air conditioning. Um, it's primarily a heating zone and not all that much heat at that. But this year, and as you can tell, but I, I don't know if anybody can hear it because it's very quiet, the air conditioning is on right now for the eighth time this year and we're only in the second week of August, uh, the first second week of August. The thing about heat pumps is you get air conditioning for free and the reason we have almost no utility bill is the photovoltaic cells generate the electricity that runs the heat pump and generates the elec excess electricity that we feed into the grid when it needs it and we take back what we need to heat um, mm -hmm. during the nights and the cool nights in the winter. To your right is the storage tank and the uh, heat exchanger is the smaller one in the middle for the domestic uh, hot water and as you have in some of your other shots you can see the uh, solar panels on the roof that gather the heat. So basically the sun heats the water, um, it puts uh, 119 gallons of hot water in this tank on any reasonably hot day. Most of the year it'll heat up enough water for our demands and uh, then we draw that out as needed.